going on is to do an update on the stream and the waterfall. And this right here is a philodendron that is growing up the wall here on the waterfall. And that just amazes me how it grows and attaches itself to the rock. We got flowers blooming. And these plants are growing in only about two or three inches of water. And it's making its own uh, root system and the silt that comes out of the uh, pond. And it's grown to where it's cascading down the front of the waterfall. And I've got all these plants growing in the stream to filter out the silt. And Ellie's trying to go through it. Don't you get in there, Ellie. She's trying to get in the water. But it goes back to the pond here. And it's growing all over the end of the waterfall there. I didn't put any river rock in this part, so it has its own root system. There's a few uh, big rocks in there, but not any river rock, not any of the smaller rocks like some of the other stream. But it just amazes me how this is growing and thriving until we get a hard freeze and then it burns it back. But it is cascading over the wall of this uh, waterfall here. And there's my supply line and it's kind of hid, but not as much as I would like. And the other day I was sitting here and I noticed that right in here is uh, holes that goes there on the inside of the uh, waterfall, like on the underside. I thought about uh, filling in the holes there, but then I thought, no, I'll just leave it open for critters to have their home, lizards and snakes and stuff like that. But we got this begonia thrives in water and it's blooming. Spanish petunias blooming there. And I'm just amazed at how stuff grows in the fish poop that's in the water, I'm sure is a good fertilize for all these plants. You used to could see the stream in this one. This different this is a different waterfall and I just let the flowers uh, take over here so that's having its own filter system and then it comes out here the water's not as clear as I would like I put some uh, muck away in there a few months ago and it didn't really clear it up like it has in the past so the bottom
bottom is still dark in the pond. These flowers is just really grown up. Blooming real pretty. And my horses, they love this stuff right here. These white flower things here, it's really a weed, but they love it. They eat it like cotton candy. But it's got like uh, little sticks on it that I call hitchhikers that'll stick to your pants leg and your dog or anything that touches it. But look at these Spanish petunias. And that's another flower that just thrives in water. And I didn't even know that until I went to a, a place that sells rock, river rock and gravel and stuff. And they had some in their pond and that gave me the idea to put it in my pond. So it's actually in the edge here and it grows you can see it across the pond right there it's got it everywhere and there fish are hanging out right there you used to could see the bottom right there but right now it's dark but that's okay They love it down here. As my mom would use, used to say that the fish love it here. <laughs> I miss my mama. She passed away this past May. Now it's October the 7th, I think, today. The day I win the $1.4 billion lottery. That would be a miracle. And here's the other waterfall. I have three. And I had that begonia cut back a few months ago, but it's already growing down to the edge of the spillway there. This plant right here is my hibiscus. And these bulbs right here, you can, once they turn brown, you can get the seeds out of them and plant them. Let them germinate and plant them and get more hibiscus. My mama planted that years ago. And here's one of the bridges. You can see the hibiscus is really thriving here. and the Mexican petunias all down through there giant elephant ears philodendron see the philodendron growing all over this handrail first built this stream it wasn't so full of flowers and the birds would come and 
in it by the thousands and take a bird bath. My daddy and my mom got to see all of that when they were living here. I need to thin this out though, because one of my spillways is right there. Or cascades. Maybe thin that out a little bit. Here's my shrimp plant. And it's actually growing bigger than it ever has right there. Here's one of my other bridges with the philodendron growing up the handrail. And all down through there's the stream. Got two azaleas planted right there on the side. Still waiting for this tree to rot and fall on down without falling on anybody. I need to thin this out again so you can actually see the river rock in the water. And then that is the cement pond over there. That's where the water from the pond enters. Comes up through a English style builder system where the water comes in at the bottom comes up through river rock and then a lot of uh, pea gravel where it's like a sediment filter system. The water comes up and then the silt and stuff stays in the bottom and I actually vacuum it out with a pump actually next month I do it once a year and I have two uh, pipes below the water there that I put a pipe down in and just Draw it out with the pump. Oh, there's a little frog right there on that rock. And this used to be a little clearer there, but it's kind of grayed up. I'm trying to get vines to grow on this formerly tiki hut because I got tired of cutting palms and putting them up there and the only thing that's growing right now on this is my honeysuckle and it's slowly growing but I'm trying to get it to just give me a little shade Nothing spectacular, but a little shade, and it's just taking forever, though, for it to grow. And I tried planting, uh, tried planting uh, morning glory over here, and every piece that I've planted so far has just died. But I gotta get some, uh, sand and put in here for the hibiscus seeds that I'm planting. I've got one piece of what I think is morning glory that's still green there. So it might, it might start running. 
let's see, I planted this piece yesterday and watered it and hopefully it'll hang on and grow. I hope so because I need some shade here. All right, that's the update on the stream.